Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex, if you're new. Uh, today, I wanted to share with you, well, I'm gonna be testing something. Uh, I picked up this lip liner from Satchu? Satchu Beauty? I don't know. Uh, I think I saw this on TikTok. It's essentially one of those like peel off stains. And I was very intrigued because the girl looked like she had a very similar skin tone to me and I really liked the color of it. And I'm all about stains, but it's very hard to find stains that are not like too pink or too orange or too red. I wanted to give it a shot and I figured I would take you along for the ride. So my lips are clean. I just, uh, they might actually look a little bit dry. So this is the lip liner stay in, stay in, stay. Oh, that's a cute name. I actually like that. Look, lip liner stain. So this is the peel off lip liner tattoo. And this one is in the shade mauve. E M U A H dash V E number two. So they have, I think they had three colors. I can't remember, but this is the one that the girl in the TikTok was using. If I can find it, I'll link it. I can't, I was one of those things where I like swiped by or swiped onto it really quickly, immediately bought it and then kind of forgot about it. You know what I mean? So I think the only thing I'm worried about is that the applicator is a little thick. What I know about these products is that you need to like glob it on so that you can actually peel it. If you make it too thin, then you won't be able to peel it off. So the reason that I was interested in, let me just talk about it forever. The reason I was interested in this is because, you know, I like to overline my lips a little bit and you know, you're eating and stuff. And that's like the first thing that comes off is your lip liner. And then you're just like, it doesn't look right. Your lip doesn't look right. Cause you're like, the whole point of this was the structure uh, that I've completely lost now, like it's gone. So I thought this would be kind of a, an interesting product. So I'm gonna try to um, overline my lips the way that I usually do. So I'm gonna go just above my lip line and I wanna make sure that it's thick so I can peel it off. I'm worried about it just being like a line though. Like, can you fade it at all? Okay. I'm worried about this. I have to go somewhere after this, so I hope it doesn't end up looking like completely crazy because this looks crazy. The applicator needs to be pointier. I can't smile. All right, I think that's thick enough. Now I don't, let me just zoom you out now. I don't know, it didn't come with any instructions for like how long I should wait. Let me look it up while we wait. This is such a dope look. Let's just like fucking live. Let's just live like this. Oh, you can get it at Walmart. Satchi Beauty Lip Liner Stain. So it's $12. That's pretty cheap. They have four shades. Oh, just kidding. They have three shades. Movi, Pinked, and Nudie. Can you tell me how to use it? Use the precision tip applicator is a little generous. I would say it's not necessarily super precise. Like that's a thick ass line, dude. Trace along the lip line in an even layer. Leave on for up to 20 minutes. After formula has set, use, after formula has set, use fingers to slowly peel the film tint off to unveil smudge proof long wear lip color. Okay. Oh, look at all the videos of happy customers. Oh, I like this girl just did it in like certain areas. That's a good idea. Let's do that next time. Here's a review. Very good, five stars. I love this product. I've been trying to find a good lip stain and I think I found one because it's super easy and less messy than other lip stains. Okay, not the best written review. It stays on for long. Love the color on me. Okay, it works so well. I will definitely order again. See, this is in all caps. It stays for so long and overall a 10 out of 10. All right, people seem happy. 
At least that's what they're showing us. Oh, it's definitely huh, dried. 12 bucks is good. I think I'm gonna take it off now. All right, ready? Let's peel this shit. It feels like it's set. Ready, everybody? I'm nervous. Ow. <gasps> Ew, it looks like a rotten banana peel. Okay, I like that color. That's like a decent, that's like a decent color. Oh, I'm pleasantly surprised. It is just a fucking line though. <laughs> it is literally just a line. Ah, do you see? Uh, corners of my mouth. Cool. They're a little uneven, but that's typical of me. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, let's go just go in with like a little bit of a nude Lipstick? It is just like a line. That's the only thing. It doesn't seem like it would be possible to um, feather, you know, like blend out. Well, since my lips are so dry, I guess I'm just gonna go in with Auric plus Ritual and Bear. See how that looks? Cause that's my typical, that's my go-to lip is just like a lip liner and Bear. It's definitely just a line. <laughs> That's not too bad though. What do you guys think? Especially on this side. Like this side looks a little more natural. I don't know why. I guess maybe I made this side a little too thick. The color's really nice. I like the color a lot. Like very, very nice. <laughs> this is silly. All right, I'm gonna blot that and put on just like a nude lipstick. I'm gonna see if there's any difference. Well, I'm wiping my lips and it doesn't appear to be coming off. I didn't leave it on for very long, which is also impressive. Maybe it came off a little bit. Obviously the longer you leave it on, I'm assuming it'll be a little darker, maybe last a little bit longer. Um, what's a nude lipstick? I need a little nude lipstick. All right, this is e.l.f. No doubt lipstick. Ooh, ooh, perfect match. I mean, not completely, but whatever. Okay, I'm not mad at it. I think it works. I'm just gonna blow this, see how it looks. As it fades, what's gonna, what's popping? Okay, I'm like not mad at that. It actually works with that lipstick really nicely. If you're someone who like, your lips, lip liner is the first thing to fade, which mine definitely is, I actually think it's like a pretty cool product. The color's really nice. For my skin tone, it's so hard to find something that like, you know, is legit. Like lip liner is one of the hardest things. I really like that. My only um, criticism is that the, if the, if the applicator, where did it go? I feel like the applicator should be pointier on the top and a little thinner. Like if it got thinner at the top and a little pointier, I think it would be better, but maybe it wouldn't apply enough product for it to be peeled off. I don't know, that's the only downside. I feel like the next time I use this, I might use a tiny angled brush and just pick up a decent amount so that I have a little more precision, you know? Because I do feel like my lips look a little bit uneven and it's like, it's a stain. So if you don't get them perfect, there's no, you know, removing it. Um, but overall, I do really like the color. I think this is a product that I'm gonna be coming back to quite a bit. I'm very interested very interested, especially in a stain that is not too orange or red. And especially something that's marketed as a lip liner. Kind of love it. I don't know, what do you guys think? Uh, it matches this lip color almost perfectly, so that's good. I don't know how well it worked with Auric. 
maybe a little too sheer, but if you're, you know, using a lip lipstick, then if you're out at dinner or a party or something, it's a hell of a lot easier to just kind of like slap on a little more lipstick uh, and not have to worry about your lip liner than like go into the bathroom and have to like fix your structured lip, you know? Uh, all right guys, that's it for this video. Just a little quick try out, little, little first impressions test. Uh, let me know if there are specific colors that you would like to see me use with this. Next time I saw a video on their little website of a girl who just did like up here, a little bit here and then like down here, kind of like that, a little more contouring. I think I might try that next time. Let me know if you want to see that. Yeah, dude, I don't know. We're figuring this shit out together, man. <sighs> if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and do all the things. And let me know what you want to see next. I, I, it's impossible for me to make that sentence be a sentence. It's just a word. Let me know what you want to see next. Let me know what you want to see next. I've had too much green tea. I have places to be.